it's one of the special things about New York that everybody who comes here brings his or her culture. And so what you have in Brooklyn is a culture of beer. You could argue that Brooklyn was about the brewing capital of the United States. Three of the largest breweries in the country were, were right there in Brooklyn. Lager beer had undergone a tremendous popularization to the extent that it had become a national beverage. It's booming right up until Prohibition, and then we kick it in the teeth. The Miss Rheingold contest, or election, could take a girl from the sticks and make her a superstar. And the fact that we outspent every other brewer in New York to do this is what made us the number one beer in New York. And then the industry in the mid-1970s just dies here. The stars are in alignment for Brooklyn to do better. We're going to make high-quality beers of different styles, uh, the kind of beers that are not being made here in the U.S. Brooklyn homebrewing has exploded. It's absolutely huge right now. A big part of the job is just walking people through the process. We are the smallest commercial brewery in the world. And it kind of died out for a while, and now it's coming back, where you can refill a glass jug. We'll be brewing beer shortly. <laughs>